hope y'all are having an amazing day today. Also, guys, happy holidays from yours truly, me and Bestie. Also, happy new year if you're seeing this in 2018. Yeah, guys, anyway, today we are going to be checking out something pretty dang awesome. Now, for those of you guys that did not know, uh, about a few months ago, I checked out this mob, but since then, it has been updated, and I definitely wanted to play around with it a tad bit more because, uh, I've gotten quite a few suggestions to check out more golems in Minecraft, but I picked this suggestion out of all the others. JM suggested that I checked out the golems mod, just like a bunch of you guys as well. So guys, if you want to be featured just like your boy Jay, all you gotta do is leave a huge like on today's video. It's free, it is awesome. Also guys, subscribe and then turn on notifications so that you never miss out on a brand new video. And yeah guys, just comment any mod you want to see down below. And then hopefully in the future, I will definitely check it out. Hey, Bessie, wait, wait, I, I meant to show you something cool, right? 3, 2, 1, bam. Oh, well, that wasn't supposed to happen. <laughs> Thanks, Doc. Uh, don't worry, guys, I got the Doc to come in, and then he fixed Bessie right up. Wow, I did not expect that to kill you. I'm very, very sorry, Bessie. Bessie probably just is sick and tired of always dying in my videos. But, guys, today, as you probably already know, we're going to be creating some awesome brand new iron golems. Some of them are worse than, you know, the current golem that you already know and love. But some of them are a crap ton better. So I'm super excited to check them out today. We're going to have diamond golems, TNT golems, bookshelf golems, aka librarians. And then, guys, we also have some more stuff in here. So Bessie has gathered some uh, brand new armor for me. I think it's part of a different mob. It's called Simmerite. We also have a weedwood bow, some pretty... Pretty cool arrows that say use with caution so I mean we're just gonna use them anyway and we also have angler meat as our food today I'm not really sure if I like angler but I mean I'm definitely gonna find out today but yeah guys and then last but not least in this chest we have some crazy boss mobs that we're going to be putting these golems against to test out how strong they are and this helmet really blocks my eyes. Stink it, Bessie. I know I killed you and all, and you're probably angry at me, but here, you can have that stupid little hat back. But anyway, guys, first things first. I need to show you guys how to actually create these custom golems. So, I believe the uh, starting point is with the golem head. Now, in order to get the golem head, you can't just use pumpkins, okay? You gotta combine a pumpkin with a golem spell. And this is all of the different golems that you can create. But to get the golem spell, it is feathers, redstone, paper, and an ink sack. Now, you have to do this for every single one. So, you should probably make some sort of mob farm or something so that, you know, you can get all these awesome items. But yeah, guys, once you do have a crap ton of golem heads, just like I have right here, then you can start creating your custom awesome upgraded golems. All right, so let's just grab all of these blocks in here and we'll just start spawning them in now i want to get a nice golem army before i start spawning in some uh, crazy minecraft mobs so let's see first things first let's try out a crafting table guy all right we go got a shift right click now i believe that they're all built the exact same way and then once i'm done i just place the golem head on oh my god the golem head on top <laughs> look at that holy crap we have our shelves a, what is this, a crafting table golem? Wait, can I craft with you? Holy crap, that is awesome. I can right click on them and then craft with them. That is definitely pretty dang cool. But there we go. We have the first guy and we have a crap ton of other guys to get through. So let's just start spawning them all in. Next up, we have a magma block. Now, I'm also 99% sure that these guys all have their own special abilities. So obviously, the crafting table one, I can craft using him. I think the magma guy might set mobs on fire. But we'll have to test that out in just a few minutes here. But anyway, next up, we have the bone block. So there's a couple new golems in here that I can get because this is a brand new version. What the flip? Guys, 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 Mr. Bone, don't help me. Bro, 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 bro. Ah, okay, okay, I'm ready. Oh my goodness, I did not mean to do this. Okay, all right, man, bam. Oh gosh, okay, I should be able to take him out. Holy crap, bam. Okay, all right, what the, okay, yes, please help me. Please help me, bro. Bro, why are they running from him? What, do these guys not want to kill it? Wait, what the heck are they going for? No, dude, can you please help me? Gosh dang, yes, thank you so much. Please, I need some assistance. Holy crap. Yes, wait, how is he not dead? Oh my goodness. Thank you so much, dude. Uh, doctor, I, you already fixed Bessie. What are you trying to do now? Bro, back to flip up. What the heck? I, you, you already fixed Bessie. There's nothing else to do. Stop harassing her, all right? But anyway, guys, now that we're done with that little thing, let's spawn in some more golems. All right, so let's see. Next up, we have a slime golem. All right, there we go. Whoa, he has 85 health. So I kind of forgot. They also have different varying levels of health. Why do they like it in the water? 
I feel like that's really weird, but hey, I don't decide what they like and they don't like, they decide. All right, bam, there we go. We have a Leaf Golem. He only has six health, but I'm pretty sure he has regeneration as well, but I'm assuming he's gonna die really quick. They all love going in this pond. All right, I'm just not gonna question it. Here we go. Next up, we have our uh, very scary guy. We have a TNT Golem. Oh, whoops. Sorry about oh, crap. What the flip? Everything just broke instantly. All right, let's try this again. Golem head. Bam. Okay. Don't blow up on me, bro. I'm pretty sure he suicide bombs once he actually sees a bad guy. All right, so there we go, guys. We have our first golems inbound. Let's go see who else we got. I don't think I need that bow right now. Ooh, we have endstone, glass, bookshelves. All right, let's try out the endstone guy right now. I think this guy has a chance of teleporting around. We also have a glowstone guy. Now, I'm pretty sure, yeah, he definitely has to light up areas. Let's see. If I set it to nighttime time, shit, night. Let's see. Yep, he definitely glows. All right, bam. That is awesome. Good to have him around, except he looks kind of weird with all that red on him, but I'm just not going to question that either. Let's see. Next up, we have another brick. I wonder how this guy's going to look. All right, let's go see. Whoa, he looks pretty dang scary. Look at that. He's got like nether warts running down his side. That looks so cool. All right, let's see. Next up is a wooden golem. All right, let's spawn this bad boy in. What's that, man? My name's Jack. All right, yeah, go ahead. Run over to the pond like everybody else does. I don't understand. Maybe they're trying to protect that one doctor over there that I got for Bessie. But I mean, I guess that's a good thing. They can protect the doctor if they really want to. But let's go shoot. Next up, we have a nice old-fashioned glass golem who has eight health and looks so weird. Look at that. You can see all his insides. Ugh, that's disgusting. All right, let's go see. Let's spawn in a librarian golem. Let's see. Oh, this guy looks so funny. Look at that. He looks like he has glasses on, too. His eyes are just all messed up. And it looks like he has, what is that, regeneration on him? He has some sort of effect on him, which is pretty dang cool. But there we go. We just added, like, six or seven new golems to the party. Now we have a few more to get through here. Bam, just like that. And then we also have diamonds. All right, so let's spawn in. Ooh, next up, an obsidian golem. This guy has to be better than an iron golem. Let's see. Yeah, 120 health, and he has to do a decent bit more damage. I think the regular iron golem does like 10 attack damage. So I'm assuming that he probably does a little bit more. And I really just messed up right now. All right, bam, there we go. Let's spawn in a hardened clay golem. Now, I think you could spawn these in, yeah, in any color that you want. Same goes for the wool golems. You can use any color of wool that you really please. And I'm pretty sure you can change them as well. Like if I had black wool, I could right click on them. Oh, what the? I could change his outfit? That is awesome. Hold on, wait, can I change you? Look at that. I could just right click on them and I could change their color. Okay, what color do I want this guy to be? Oh, that looks pretty damn cool. Let's do it. Huh, what do I want? Okay, you. Yeah, I think the black vest looks pretty damn cool. And I guess this guy. Oh, a nice green golem. That definitely looks flipping awesome. All right, let's go see. Next up, we have a Lapis Lazuli Golem. All right, what's that, dude? Welcome to the gang. All right, he looks like he's probably half as good as a regular Iron Golem. All right, let's see. Block of Gold. Now they should start getting pretty dang OP. All right, let's see. He only has 80 health. Uh, I guess they're not as strong as Iron. He may do a little bit more damage, though. All right, guys, and the last two we have is an Emerald Golem right there. And then last but not least, we have a Diamond Golem. All right, let's see. Bam, look at that. 220 health, 190 health. And guys, there is still one golem better. Now, sadly, he is uh, kind of reserved for creative mode only. So it's not like you could get this in survival mode because it is the bedrock golem. All right, so let's throw all these blocks away. I might keep the diamond and the emerald on me just in case the golems bite the dust and I need to spawn in more. Now, right, there we go. But let's grab in. I'm going to spawn in two bedrock golems. All right, here we go, boys. Let's spawn in one right there. Now, they have 990 health and I'm pretty sure that they're impossible to damage so these guys are invincible by the way the only way to get rid of them is to right click them again with the spawning they'll kind of just vanish but yeah let's keep those two dudes there just in case things get a little bit crazy but guys I think we are pretty much good to go to start fighting these crazy minecraft bosses all right there we go got my nice angler meat we got all the golems inbound hopefully they don't start trying to kill each other but let's go see what we have all right we have a lurker a dark druid 
squid. Oh, this should be super fun. All right, we have a beast, a pirad, a tar minion, and a primordial malevolence. Sounds fun. All right, let's do it. Let's go see. All right, let's spawn in. Looks like we have a little click starting over here. Let's spawn in a nice little lurker. What's that, dude? Whoa, who just set him on fire? I think the nether brick golem set this dude on fire. Holy crap, he's getting wrecked. Oh my goodness. Now they all do different levels of damage as well. So like the wool iron golem will only do a little bit of damage while the diamond golem, I'm pretty sure does like 20 attack damage, which is just crazy. All right, let's go see. Let's spawn in a dark druid. What the flip, he just teleported. Holy crap, look at that dude. Look at him, oh my gosh, guys, they're wrecking him. All right, let's try and spawn in three dark druids. Oh no, I'm getting picked up. What the, he just threw me. Holy crap. It doesn't look, oh, he just threw the bed. I go, whoa, bro, whoa. Get the flip away from me, bam. Okay, wait, can I use the sword on you? Bam, oh, what the heck? Holy crap, sorry about that, Iron Golem. What the, he keeps teleporting. Uh, Mr. Bedrock Golem, can I please have some help, bro? Okay, just gonna stay over here. Don't look at me, don't look at me, bro. Hey, man, can you go kill that guy, please? Please, because I don't want to go kill him. Okay, I'm just going to leave him over there. Let's try a dark druid just against you. Okay, can you help me, dude? What the flip? He doesn't even want to flip and help me. Okay, man. Okay, please. Somebody. Anybody. No one wants to kill this guy. All right, maybe if I spawn him. No, they're following me. Maybe if I spawn him in right here. All right, let's see. You guys want to fight him? Oh, he just picked up the TNT guy. Holy crap. Wait, does the TNT dude explode? Hold on. Let's go see. Please, guys, I need some help. Okay, bam. Get the flip back. All right, so so far, I think these guys are doing a decent job. Let's uh, chop on some angler meat for just a second here. And let's spawn in a swamp hag. What the heck? This dude is disgusting. Oh my goodness. Oh, dude, they just wreck him. Like, no one stands a chance against these crazy iron golems. This dude just, he's so excited. Look at that. He's just running around. He's like, dude, who's next? Let me at him. All right, man. I'll give you somebody. Let's uh, fight a Chiramo wall. What the heck? Yo, somebody, somebody, anybody, please. Oh, my goodness. Get this thing away from me. Okay, please, anybody. You guys are really bad at this. All right, come on. Anybody. Please? Are you guys flipping serious? Holy crap. They couldn't even hit him. All right. Next up, we have a tar beast. Now, I'm going to spawn him right next to the villager. Maybe they'll move in. Oh, crap. He has 100 health. He just took down a golem. Holy crap. Okay. The diamond. Go oh, my goodness. The diamond golem just did a crap ton of damage, and the villager just got wrecked. Oh, sorry about that, dude. All right. Let's go see. Oh, like Everyone's surrounding my house. I'm not entirely sure why. But let's spawn in a Pyrad right there. What the flip? Okay, let's spawn in two Pyrads. Let's spawn in a Dark Druid. And then also, let's spawn in two Torbies. Let's go see if they can handle that. All right, let's see. They're just moving in. They're, they're definitely killing stuff. What the? Oh, my goodness. What is happening over there? Whoa, we have a Dark Druid on me. Holy crap. Oh, they're getting wrecked. This is an actual good battle right now. Whoa, this guy looks so cool. So we have the Endstone Golem. Oh, someone just got taken down. The TNT Golem does not care. He's like, good luck, guys. All right, good thing they're not attacking me just yet. Looks like our Wooling go Okay, the Wooden Golem just bit the dust, or he's about to. I think, yeah, he has two health left. Oh, my goodness. So these guys can fly, which may be a little bit of an issue. I should probably help them out a little bit. Bam, there you go, boys. What the flip? No, I'm on fire. No, 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 no. No, I don't want to be on fire. Oh, the Endstone guy can teleport, too. That is flipping awesome. Why is everything fighting me? Yo, Mr. TNT Golem, can you go suicide bomb somebody, please? C can you just do that for me? Come on, let let's let's see it. What the flip, bro? Guys, guys, I'm getting sucked in. Guys, what the flip is happening? He just sucking everybody in. No, 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 I'm gonna die. Holy crap! Nope, not today. Not today. I have all these golems that are just sitting around doing flipping nothing. So, oh my goodness, I thought my house was on fire for a second. These guys are having a pool party while we're over here fighting for our lives. All right, you're doing great. So it looks like we still have the TNT Golem and uh, the Bedrock Golem, the Emerald Golem just took down the last of the dudes. But yeah, it seems like most of the low powered Golems kind of maybe died there. The Librarian died. I think the Endstone guy died. So it looks like now we just have kind of like the overpowered golems. All right, that's probably somewhat of a good thing because next up we have a Tar Minion and also a Primordial Malevolence. Not entirely sure what that is. I believe that is going to probably wreck my day, but let's spawn some of these dudes in. So it looks like the Obsidian guy is doing pretty good. Our TNT Golem does not give two craps. Uh, Emerald Golem took a little bit. Uh, the Lapis Lazuli guy... About halfway down, we have the slimy golem over here. All right, let's spawn in a tar minion right here. What the? How much? He has 60 health? What does this do? Whoa! Whoa! 
Sorry, man. I'm sorry about that. I'm so sorry. Okay, go. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. I, I didn't mean it. Bessie. Bessie's dead. Go oh, crap. All right. I guess I'll have to find a new doctor to fix up Bessie because this doctor may have actually gotten killed earlier. All right. Why is this thing attacking me? What the flip, bro? He does not stop. All right, Mr. Bayrock, um, can you please help me? Or can I get on your shoulder or something? Dude, he does not flip and stop. Okay. I guess I have to fight him. What the flip? Get away from me, bro. Get the flip away from me. Okay, come on. Back up. Back up, bro. What? He just dodged all my flipping attacks. All right, let's see. Come on, man. Stop it. I'm fighting a tiny little minion thing. Okay, chill. Chill, actual dude. I'm sorry. We can be friends. Okay, come on. Come on, man. Come on. Oh, my goodness. Ew, that was disgusting. Oh, my goodness. I got black stuff all over me. All right, guys. I think we have how many golems left? We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven golems left to fight the primordial malevolence. All right, boys. Here we go. Three, two, one. Bam. Okay, run. I'm out. I'm out, guys. Oh, what the heck? Whoa. What is that? What the? I'm getting teleported. What the? Okay, can I use this thing? What the? How do I hit it? What is inside of that thing? Okay, what the flip? Whoa, I can't even hit him. All right, what the heck? He's spawning in, guys. He's spawning in minions. Okay, got to take him out. Get the heck out of here. Oh, my goodness. Sorry about that, golems. What the flip? Okay, uh, guys, I need some assistance. We only have one golem actually doing something. All right, where the flip are the rest of the golems? Yo, guys, you, you want to help or something? Because this thing just keeps teleporting me. All right, guys, I need some help. What the heck? All right, maybe if I do this. Like, how do I take this dude out? Oh, no. Not you again. Not flipping you again. Bam. Get the heck out of here. All right. Uh, I need some assistance. I need more golems. All right, guys. So this guy just keeps trapping me. I can't run away to my other golems. So I think I'm going to have to wrap up this video here. By the way, guys, if you do want to see some more golem mods, because I'm pretty sure there's a crap ton. I mean, golem mods are probably my second favorite because, you know, minions are just awesome to have in Minecraft. Second to boss battles. I really love boss battles, too. Except for this dude who just keeps teleporting me. And for some reason, I can't even hit. But, hey, guys, nonetheless, if you did enjoy, please feel free to go leave a like on today's video. Subscribe. And then do not forget to tap that bell to turn on notifications so you never miss out on a brand new video. But yeah, guys, that is pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed. My name is Beckbro Jack, and I will see you guys all back again here tomorrow. Peace out, dudes.